gosh, get into it. Hey Fluff Bunnies, it's your girl Fluffy and I'm back with another video. But before we get started with today's celebrity team, make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe on the video. Oh, I'm not a feeling my little twist here. Whatever, that's beside the point. <laughs> But anyways, you guys, today let's get started. We are going to talk about rapper Doja Cat. Now, let's talk about it first. I was originally going to pass this one up because I definitely don't like bringing up things that have to do with racism or and <laughs> Everybody gets all funky about it. They get funky. They get funky. They get funky. Okay, so... With that being said, let me catch you on up about what's going on with rapper Doja Cat. So if you guys did not know, she is being drugged across the social media platforms right here, right now. So if you don't know why, let me tell you why. Rapper Doja Cat, I don't know who dug it up, but all I can tell you is, baby, they brought up some things from her past, some things that happened a few years ago. However, because they're so prominent right now in today's society, the world is not very forgiving of her actions so recently it has surfaced an old tiny chat video of rapper doja cat kind of hanging out trying to look sexy and sultry in front of a bunch of white boys and it come to find out that this particular group of tiny chatters were an affiliated group with racism saying racist connotations um, racial slurs and things like that so in the video, you can kind of hear Doja Cat saying some racist slurs. It's very hard to hear. This is not my quality. This is just some quality I found online. It is by far the best quality that I can find online. So I'm hoping you guys can go ahead and decipher what you hear from it. And then let's talk about it in the comments. Now, let's listen to it. Gag reflexes, my loose lady of the night, Doja. <laughs> so easy and loose. Let's go to the oh. end. And only two mm -hmm. stories. Yes, daddy. Oh, oh my God. God. Yeah. Her shirt reminds me of a baby duck. Uh, her shirt is like a... Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> and I... Oh. So now that we've listened to it, let's decipher a little bit further. So not only is she being blamed for that, but then she's also being blamed because of a song that has resurfaced that Doja Cat first came out with before she was super famous and before she was really Doja Cat. The song is titled Didn't Do Nothing. Now, if you don't know what the mean or the term didn't do nothing is, let me break it down to you. Didn't do nothing is a term that they use to make fun of black people when they get in trouble with the police. So something like, oh, Oh, you know I got pulled over with you know for a ticket but I didn't do nothing see how I race this ass sounds okay got it so basically she comes out with this song it's not very clear what the purpose of this song is however Doja Cat has released an apology today after the last couple of days where she's been being drugged in the mud and says that hey I I know that I did the song I know that the song has resurfaced but I was trying to change the narrative of this of the words didn't do nothing because of what i experienced she's not very clear on what she experienced she just said that she's had a couple racist experiences and her version of hey i was trying to like combat it was i came out with this song called didn't do nothing now again i'm not sure if this was a very heartfelt apology it is quite a lengthy apology you guys can definitely go and read it it is up um i will have a picture here for you as well and um this is a kind of tough one to call and you might be asking why am why is this tough for me to call and i'm gonna say this because this is not the first time that doja cat has been accused of saying some very hurtful things that can hurt a group of people not just one person but a group of people oh who has got hot i gotta get out of here I'm dumb. I'm, I'm, I, yeah. Mm. Okay. So again, this is not the first time that she's been accused of saying something that can hurt a group of people. <sighs> Let's go back to 2015. I don't know if you guys know, but at one point in time, Doja Cat was very affiliated with Tyler, the creator. However, she has some kind of harsh tweets that are out there too. And I do have the receipts for you. Openly, she tells Tyler and Earl that they are a bunch of faggots. Now, again, the word is very derogatory in meaning, and we all know that that is a definite, you know, 
and definitive way to come at someone who is part of the LGBTQ and come at them very harshly. So she has it in tweets. So again, here we are, here's the internet world with the proof. And she's telling us like, hey, you know, I'm sorry, I've said the word faggot several times over 15,000 times in my lifetime and I deserve fame and notoriety too. That was basically her apology back in 2015 for the faggot situation. So now here we are again with proof of her taking part in something that can offend several groups of people and she's apologizing for it. So I have to question her, her, her character at this point. I have to question it. I don't know about you guys, but I'm definitely questioning because it seems like she's always getting caught up for some stuff that she says and then she's quickly to be, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean it like that. So let me ask you this, Doja. Are you sorry because you got caught or are you sorry because you genuinely mean it and it was like, hey, I was young, dumb, and stupid then, but now that I've grown up, I would really just love for you guys to forget my past and let me move forward because I'm a different person now. So I don't know, you guys be the ones to tell me, is Doja Cat sorry for her actions? Should we forgive her? Should we not cancel her? Because you guys know, black Twitter don't play no games, y'all. They have been dragging her for two days and they have since canceled her, they have apologized to her and then they canceled her again. So is Doja Cat canceled or not? I mean, because if so, she canceled just like summer 2020 is because baby, it's hot out here. I can tell you that right now. It's hot. The birds is chirping. So I'm not really sure, but I do know this much. Doja Cat, some things are better left unsaid, honey. And maybe we shouldn't just say some things and you shouldn't say them on public forums because it always comes back to bite you in the ass and it's clearly biting your ass. It's kind of like, you know, remember the dad on Friday when he got his butt bit and he was like, the dog was like, Arr! you know, remember that? <laughs> well, Doja, how your ass feel? That part. So are we canceling Doja or are we not y'all? That's my question for y'all. And if we not gonna cancel her, should we forgive her? Cause I mean, we've all said some things. You know what I'm saying? I done said some things in my life, honey, that I ain't mean. I done said some things. I've been biased before. I've said some discriminatory, you know, derogatory terms. And I didn't did all that too. I ain't innocent. So do we forgive her or do we not? You know what I'm saying? Has the Lord forgiven her yet? I need to know. Maybe I need to go talk to God first and see if God forgave her. Because if God forgave her, then I can too. You know what I'm saying? And quite frankly, I don't really listen to her music. I just know that, you know, her song became super popular on TikTok. <laughs> that, I oh, don't you say shit. That, that shit gets on my nerves. It does. It does. It really does. It does okay but anyways y'all so are we forgiving her or not let me know in the comments i definitely want to hear from you guys so let's get this conversation going and make sure you are super polite to people and respect people in their space in the comments and um oh side note you might have wondered who did my makeup i did it myself <laughs> it would look cute today so with that being said i did use poppy lashes for these uh good uh eyelashes these are called chulo and the glitter is also from poppy lashes as well so definitely check him out when you get a chance and um with that being said y'all i am out for the day i truly appreciate y'all being here with me oh, won't he do it <laughs> that part honey yes stay up to date with me make sure you like share and comment and subscribe <laughs> Bye. Oh, that was cute. That was sultry. <laughs> yes. <laughs> now I'm kind of sad because I'm going to go take this makeup off. And I did so good. And I ain't got nobody to go see because we in quarantine. Help. Send help. Send help. Bye, y'all. For real. Bye.